Tomorrow is April 15th, the traditional deadline to file your taxes. It's been postponed because of COVID-19, but some taxpayers still have to pay tomorrow. CBS News' Jim Williams found out the rules are hurting some of the people getting hit hardest already by this virus. Jim. Brad, small business owners, independent contractors, gig workers, they are all in this group, and they wonder why at this time during a crisis, the deadlines are not the same for everyone. Jill Bishop is the owner of a successful business with employees around the world, but this tax season is a head scratcher. It's confusing. Uh, I have an email from my CPA that I think I had to read seven times. Bishop, like other Illinois small business owners, gig workers, and independent contractors, has to pay her quarterly estimated taxes to the state Wednesday. Even though because of COVID-19, the IRS and state of Illinois have pushed back deadlines for other taxpayers. 80% of accountant Ted Glaziano's clients are small business owners. It seems a little unfair because those people in the gig economy are going to be the, the ones most impacted by the crisis to begin with. So now, if they don't make those estimated tax payments, they're going to be subject to some interest and penalties for not making them on time. All at a time when small business owners and gig workers are trying to stay afloat in a brutal economy. And we're all trying to go after all these uh, relief uh, loan processing right. and all these opportunities that are there to support business. And so trying to struggle with, with that on top of everything else. Uh, like let us focus on running our business, applying for grants where they exist, and let's push off this quarterly payment as long as we can. Ted Galaziano urges his clients not to panic. So contrary to what a lot of people think, um, it's a voluntary payment. Mm -hmm. um, you know, it's, it's, it's not like you're missing a deadline to make a payment. Mm -hmm. uh, you just have to be aware that you will pay some penalties and interest. A state of Illinois spokesman told us the Department of Revenue has taken many steps to give taxpayers flexibility during the COVID-19 crisis and given those who owe the estimated quarterly taxes an alternative way to calculate their liability.